Hey guys, Big John here. Uh, short video today. Basically, everything in a nutshell. Um, if you're doing something wrong and you know it's wrong, stop it. Don't do it. Um, if if you're leading somebody on, if you are making them believe something that's not true or that's not going to happen, but you make them think that it might be possible that something may happen, stop. That goes for corporations. That goes for people. Because I have so many corporations that like to sit there and will we'll give you the runaround. People, there's no use for that. There's no need in that. We're all supposed to be grown adults here. Stop. It is time to stop. People that you constantly have a feeling that you're down, that you know you can't help, you know, how you feel or what God bless. I can't even think straight. I apologize. My blood pressure is through the freaking roof. I am I have been so stressed and with everything else going on, it's just it's been it's been hell. And then, not to mention the other day, I, I, I damn near got scammed. Yeah, I legitimately damn near got scammed. Um, and I want to go ahead and let you guys know this. Because for any of you guys that watch on a computer, laptop, so on and so forth, I went to kissanime.to to watch my anime. And lo and behold... My computer started talking to me. Oh, you contracted a virus or malware or whatever, you know. If you continue, if, you know, call Microsoft and they will fix this problem. Like, like, uh. And it literally pushed me over to the Microsoft page. It literally did. And... Anyways, it, it pushed me over there, and I thought it was legit. I literally did, and so I called. Turned out, um, you know, like, dude, the dude on the other end gave me, like, all, all the codes and stuff that I needed to use on my computer, like, everything, and... <sighs> Anyways, it, it, he wound up remotely controlling, because I allowed it, um, remotely controlling my, my, my computer. I mean, the only reason I found out it was a scam, um, because I gave this guy full permission, really, I gave him permission, and all of a sudden my mouse... Started moving by itself, you know, la da da And, like, he went into my computer and started showing, you know, doing everything from wherever this guy was from. I did not know it was a scam at this time. It wasn't until the end of the phone call that I realized that it was a scam. Because at the end of the phone call, it he tried to sell me... Uh, uh, Antivirus protection and all that. He tried to sell it to me. Um, and it was like $199 for, you know, $199 for the silver plan, $299 for the gold plan, and $499 for the diamond plan. And I was like, dude. I have no money, and it was like, oh, I can see what I can do, and it, he damn near got me. He damn near got me. Like honestly, I didn't, I didn't even know it was a like until the very last. I legitimately thought this guy was from Microsoft. Legitimately thought it. And uh, 
And when you try to sell me something, I knew something was fishy. Something was up because Microsoft isn't going to do that. You know, they're, they're not going to sit there and give you this big old spiel about, like, I ain't gonna lie, it kind of scared me. That's the reason why I'm making this video, so people will know, okay, look here. If this is what comes up, just shut down your computer and go from there. Just shut it down, do a restart, and then whenever you pop back up on the internet, exit off of that shit. Because whenever I tried to exit off of the page that it put me on, it was literally like the, uh, the circle with a line through it, basically no-go. Whatever the hell it is, uh, the block symbol. Um, but I apologize about that. I'm, I'm in the middle of having a conversation with my children's mother. Yeah. <laughs> Add insult to injury. I know, rub salt in the wounds. But, anyways. Uh, your best bet is to cut it off and then, you know, like, worst goes worst, call Microsoft. Let them know, hey, this is what's up. And, like, hang on, I'll actually give you guys the number. I'm not messed up about it. The number that I called, which also made it seem legit because this is also, um, one of Microsoft's phone numbers, which is like, whoa, what the hell? It's, uh, it's, but it's like, it's like, what the hell, you know, how did this, how did this happen? You know, who, who are these people? And that number was one eight six six one eight six six four four eight nine seven eight eight. And like I said, good job, baby. Good job. Go watch TV. Yeah, go watch TV. She just finished potty training, so she's all excited, you know. <laughs> she was pee pee in the potty and all that good jazz. But anyways. So if you see that number pop up or whatever, you know, take caution. Caution. Don't don't mess around with people like that on the internet. You know. Um. Also, uh, stay off. Like, and this this goes for like anyone who's single or whatever watching my videos. There are specific websites that I will fair warn you guys, stay away from. Um, plenty of fish is one. Actually, you know, best bet, stay off every single freaking online dating service. I have seen so many of my friends that get on these things, and the other people they meet, they're freaking nuts. Stay off of it. Don't put your shit on YouTube, or not YouTube, but... A dating website. Stay off of it. <sighs> Anyways. Um, so that's that's how I got scammed. And. It's like. It's like with everything else going on in my life. Just add the insult to injury. Just, just, just go ahead and throw that on there. You know. Um, it, it bothers me though. It really does. Because. This person was remotely controlling my computer. Like he was in my computer. Go, you know, he he has full access to my shit now. And I'm sorry, but that that's kind of scary. Um, but really, I mean, you know, what else can you do? There's really nothing else you can do. Just take heed. Take heed. Um. Anyways, <sighs> tomorrow I'll probably do a, um, an earlier video 
because tomorrow I have an appointment in uh, town over. My my PCP primary care physician. Anyways, they moved, so I have to go where they went. Which you know that's fine, that's fine. Um, but anyways, that being said. I'm just, right now, with everything else going on, this is not something that I need. It's really not. Uh, anyways, uh, do me a favor. Go play. <laughs> because of the information of about this, this, this attempted scam and everything, and how these people work, and the fact that, you know, it really lined up with Microsoft... Do me a favor, anyone who's watching this, share this video. Facebook, because these people will hack your Facebook. Obviously, dude asked me for my email address, and I didn't, you know, I was like, which one? And he got, you know, he's like, oh, it doesn't matter which email address, because I, I have my Microsoft email and my Google email. So this dude was like, it doesn't matter which one. That's scary, because... They can get on there and find out anything about you. Unless, you know, you're like me. I don't have my social on there. I don't have anything. I don't have any bank accounts. Nothing. So you're going to, you know, you're going to try to steal from me. Hey, guess what? Good luck. All you're going to get is my name. And maybe what, what apps I use. Aside from that, you ain't getting jacked. <laughs> Anyways, that being said, if you like this video, give me a thumbs up. Smash the like button. Share, subscribe. If you're new to the channel, thanks for coming. Um, but worst comes to worst, you know, like I said, be leery of what you see on the internet. This is Big John, signing out.